Kion, thank the balance you're back. Bip's been... They've taken him. Taken... yeah. Light. Are you sure it's Bip? I knew this would happen. We have no time to spare. We must get to him before... The cloud ship just unmoored and is already heading for Guillen. It's too late. Then we must follow. And abandon your mission here? For one child's life? Is it because he's a magical that he's not worth the trouble? You're such an angry, angry man. Do you really want Kian to leave Mercuria and risk his life to save one boy? I thought so. See? This is what happens when we murder Azadi soldiers just for the hell of it. That has nothing to do with it. They're taking all the magicals away. I know why, and I know what the pipes are for. What? Really? Are you serious? I'll explain later. Right now, we need to rescue the boy. Well, you're not going after him. That's not your decision to make, Anna. Can we really afford to lose more people? We've lost so many already, and the Ani has her hands full with those who've been injured. Soon, there won't be enough of us left to fight. I need to think about this. I can't just abandon the boy, but... We can't stay here. The Azadi are hunting me. The General knows I'm alive. Honey? How did that happen? Did you approach him? Are you trying to curry favors with your former masters? Curry favors? How would I even... I'm not trying to curry any favors with... Stop it, both of you! You're really annoying! And loud! Let's get out of here before all of it gets in trouble for harboring a fugitive. Shepard will want to have a say in the discussion. This isn't over, Kian. Oh, hush! Following the terrorist attack on Propast, where eight I officers and five civilians were killed by Marxist party members. The Syndicate has promised to maintain heightened security across Europolis until after the upcoming elections. The Propast district remains under full I lockdown and 24-hour curfew. We're now joined by Marek Farah in Propast. And Marek, how are regular people in Propast handling this very difficult situation? Well, Rika, as you can see, the streets here are deserted. Almost two months after the August attack on the I headquarters in Propast. There's security everywhere, and everyone who goes outside is subject to random searches and arrests. There is a 24-hour curfew in effect, but people are allowed to traverse the districts as long as they carry the appropriate paperwork and submit to any searches and questions. What about essentials like food and water, Marek? Are any stores or restaurants still open? I think this Everything is done. Everything is closed, mm, Rika, good. but rations are distributed to residents of Propast on a regular basis, and medical personnel are on constant standby. No one here is in any immediate danger of starvation. Has there been any indication of how long this lockdown will continue? The Syndicate is not saying, Rika, but spokespeople have hinted that Propast will remain under Syndicate guardianship until after the election in... It's standing up, like an animal. It hasn't we come to that yet. We have lost our connection yet. to Marek Farah in Propast. We will attempt to re-establish the connection. In the meantime, when we come back, we talk to someone very close to Marxist leader and terrorist mastermind, Marta Rebus, about her dark and... Shit. Power's out. Again. I'm sure they're doing this just to screw with us. I'll have to check the emergency fuel cell in the kitchen cabinet. It should have kicked in by now.
It's our emergency fuel cell. I can jiggle it a bit. That sometimes works. Nope, that did not work. I guess I need a new one. And I know just the person. Zoe Maya Castillo, your district is subject to syndicate mandated martial law. Please submit an approved destination or return to your home. I can find my own way, thanks. Zoe Maya Castillo, you have a history of non-compliance. I will accompany you to your approved destination. Refusal to comply will result in automatic detention and prosecution under the... <sighs> Thank you. The pandemonium is your only approved destination. I will accompany you. Please, don't talk. First sign you're living in a military state? An armed drone escorts you everywhere you go. They're lining up for rations. It's the only way to get food in Propass these days. First sign you're living in a military state, an armed drone escorts you everywhere you go. Everything's closed. No customers, no permits. I haven't seen Queenie around since I located Hannah for her. I don't miss working for Mira, but that's all. I don't miss it. But I will miss her when she leaves. She's added spice to my humdrum life. Look what the bot dragged in. Maybe it's something I ate, but I actually feel relieved to see you, Petal. Are you all right? I'm really not. You? You know, Wit is not exactly vivacious company. It's been quiet around here since we closed shop. I apologize for firing you with a pre-recorded message, by the way. Company policy. Oh, don't worry about it. You said you closed shop. There's no business. We don't even have wire access. It's like being on a really shitty desert island without sun, sand or coconuts. Or wire access. We're actually thinking about heading back to Mumbai. Well, I'm thinking about it. We will tag along wherever the road takes us. Anyway, you're here for your dreamer. What? I fixed it. You had your dream machine delivered to me because it was broken about a month ago. Does any of this ring a bell? Your friend, that German suit, said you'd come by to pick it up. He looked like a Jaeger. I thought he was here to blow my brains out but he was very personable. What was wrong with it? An early batch. Bad soldering. I fixed several like it in the past. FYI, it's an off-the-shelf model that pings Wati servers with a device ID and your biometric data as soon as you connect. That won't be a problem unless they've put an alert out on you or that particular device. But I went ahead and blocked it anyway. Still, 
It is a licensed product. There may be other security measures. I cannot be 100% sure that it won't alert Wadi. There are unlicensed streamers out there without any security chips. But Mr. London has that market locked up here in Propast. Given the trigger-happy toy soldiers out there, I wouldn't know how to get hold of one. I'll be fine with this one. As long as you know the risks. If you weren't here for that, then why the house call? Oh, a uh, fuel cell. The power went out and I don't have a working backup. That's not very smart, Kutia. Lucky for you, I'm up to my neck in fuel cells. Anything particular you're in the market for? The cheapest you have. Grab one from that box over there. They're refurbished cells, but they'll keep your apartment going for a few weeks at least. Bring it back before it goes dead. I'll refill it for you. So how much do I owe you? Consider it your severance package. If we're ever back in business, there will be a job for you. You're not too bad, Kurtia. Despite appearances. Uh, thanks, I guess. Wait, what happened to that data I decrypted for you? Who did you end up giving it to? I gave it to the Hand, but before they could publish it... They were shut down. Where's the data now? With Reza, in Iceland. Iceland. The final refuge of rogue journalists. You didn't keep a copy? I didn't want to risk it. Stupid, I know. You may have just saved your ass. Too bad about the story, though. When is your Jorbo coming back? I really don't know. When they feel it's safe, I guess. That story needs to run, Kutria. Whatever it takes, make it happen. You have expended your daily time out. I will now accompany you back to your registered domicile. Don't bother, I know the way. Every step you take, I'll be watching you, as mandated by martial law. How about every breath I... Oh, I give up. Miss Castillo? Queenie is requesting your immediate audience. Sure, but uh, what about my, uh, my escort? You have arrived at your approved location. Have a nice day. You can come on board now. Impressive. We do our best. I'm glad you're back on your feet, Zoe. I was hoping to see you again before I left. You're leaving. I heard the hand was shut down. You had friends there. Good friends. Boyfriend. The hand was going to publish an article about Watercorp conspiring with both Unity and European Dawn when the Syndicate shut them down. But they still have the evidence. My boyfriend Reza brought it to Iceland. The data's safe there, but the hand hasn't been able to publish it. There's still a chance to make things right then. This is why I wanted to speak with you. You knew the woman who set off the bomb. Nella. You were there. I tried to stop her, but it was too late. I don't believe she planned to kill anyone. She wasn't... Nella was a good person. She cared about people. She gave me something to keep safe but I lost it in the explosion. Maybe it could have explained why. Our lives are shaped by events beyond our control. The choices we make can point us down one road or the other, but where that road ultimately leads. Your friend's death was not of her own making. The device she used was rigged. It was meant to disrupt the eye, not to kill anyone. 
An EMP? How do you know this? Nela needed someone to help her assemble the device. Hannah came to me after the bombing. She was distraught. Of course, she had no idea what they were doing. But she is the link. She may be able to connect the bomb to the Syndicate. The Syndicate is behind the attack on their own people. Everyone is expendable. It all leads back to Watikorp Zoe. They are consolidating their power and ridding themselves of loose threads. I'm leaving. This city is infected, rotting from the inside. You need to leave too. But first, there's something you must do. Your memories... They're coming back. I know what I need to do. The dream machine. Be very careful. Powerful forces are converging here and elsewhere. How do you... I've been around a long time. You learn to read the signs. You're fading, Zoe. Fading? Like a page that's been left out in the sun too long. Do what needs to be done. Do not hesitate any longer. I've given you time to regain your resolve, but we're almost out of it now. If we both make it through the storm ahead, I'll find you again. I hope so. I will. Now go home and do what needs to be done. Wake up. You can come out now. How long have you known I was here? Do not mistake me for an old woman, Hana. You told her about... There's no more time for secrets. Watikorp must be brought down. What you know will make a difference. But I don't have any actual proof they were involved. I only made deliveries. You know enough. Find the evidence. Work together with Zoe. How do you know we can trust her? She's like you. Someone who shapes dreams. I know. I mean, I guess when we met. But how is that even possible? I thought I was the only one. Why do you think you were drawn together? Coincidence is a powerful force. Zoe needs your help. A terrible shadow has fallen over her. How do you know this? I don't. I'm not a fortune teller, and the future is never crystal clear. It branches and divides, indefinitely and infinitely, but there are patterns and signs, if you know where to look. Do you have to leave? They know I'm here now. Watikorp has been looking for me a long time. I'm a... a loose thread. I promise I'll find you again, Hana. Your journey is just beginning. There are wonderful things in store for you. But for now, your job is to help Zoe finish her journey. Without that, without her, there will be no more stories. Afterwards, if the universe is still here, we can talk about the next chapter.
entering my second month of sleeping without Reza. We can't even talk, seeing as he's stuck in Iceland with Baruti's data and under constant syndicate surveillance. I never knew my mother, but I've been told that in many ways she's the opposite of my father. Gabrielle never makes hasty choices. Gabrielle ponders, and when his mind's made up, he'll stick with his decision until the end. My mother's impulsive, mercurial. If the wind changes, she'll let herself be swept away with it, as long as it's to her benefit. She put me in a coma. I'm not a big fan. But maybe it's time I accept some risks. After all, I keep telling everyone I want to remember. I need to enter dream time. I need to revisit the past. It's the only way to save the future. Things didn't go too well the last time I connected to a dreamer. You returned, but you were still not here. You must be here. Is this a dream? I thought I'd actually travel across this time. You were here, but never truly. Not yet. But you must come to... Ah! What the heck was that? Oh, hey guys, what's up? Crow? Your crow? You're Crow. I remember you. You do? I am. Wait. I remember you too. Of course you do. It's me, Zoe. Don't say anything. I've got this. Lorelei. Baby Cakes. Schnoodlebum. Who? I'm... Agneta. I'm sorry. Uh, how have you been? That's not... Look, Aggie, I apologize for taking off without a word of warning. I didn't have a choice. I was needed. I'm not Agnita. I'm... Auntie May? No. Zoe. Where? Oh. Oh, Zoe. Yes! 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 The girl who was dreaming. You look... different. Are you sure you're you? <laughs> Pretty sure. I don't know. You look a lot better than you used to, and your voice, it's sultry. You sound like a cinnamon bird. I don't even know what that means. I was in a coma for a while, maybe that's... What are you doing here, Crow? Are you really here? Let me check. Yup, all here, not a feather missing. So, where is here exactly? Whoa, Nelly, I didn't expect that. Uh, you. Uh, you were. memorable. Wait, Auntie May? No? No. I was Abnoxus of the Venar. That's right. I remember you now. You were really annoying to talk to. Took ages to get anywhere. How have you been? I will not complain. I don't get it. This is just like that dream I've been having. Except for you, Crow. You're new. And improved. It's that preening routine I'm following. I'm telling you, it's a game changer. So why didn't I make it across? The connection was weak. Compromised. You were only half dreaming. Only half there. You will need to be all there. And soon, or it was too late, but you had brought the bird over. The bird will be the key. If you can just...
You must go, now. What? What's going on? Who... who are... There's little time. They are coming. But... The hallway is clear. Leave, Fräulein. Schnell. Zoe! Over here, quickly! This way. Where are we going? We need to get off the streets. Did Queenie send you? She said that you needed help. Why did you tell Queenie I wasn't doing so well? You weren't. That's not the point. I said I was fine. It wasn't up for interpretation. Sometimes it's better to just let people know rather than keep pretending. The eyes will be here soon. We need to go underground. How's that going to help? We can't just hole up in one of those chambers forever. <sighs> Trust me. What is this place? The world beneath. A network of tunnels covering all of Propast and beyond. I don't know how far it goes. This is amazing. Is this how you guys get around? For the most part. Some of the nests are only accessible from above ground, but you can get pretty much anywhere from here. Come on. Wait, where are we going? You spoke with Queenie. You know I helped Nella with that... device. The one that killed all those people. You didn't know. And neither did Nella. You're right. But someone did. Someone does, and we're gonna put it right. Mr. London has a warehouse down here. It's where I pick up and make deliveries. It was just a job, but... That's where we're going. To find evidence to connect Wattie Corp to the bombing. This warehouse, is that where London keeps his unlicensed dream machines? He keeps everything in there. Why? I need one. For after we clear Nella's name. Long story. Tell me later. We need to go. It's only a matter of time before the eyes start digging deeper. <laughs> 